guys, it's Jess and welcome back to my channel. I hope you're having a very happy and productive week. And for today's video of brain food, I wanted to share with you one of my favourite smoothie recipes. So I hope you guys enjoy and if you do, then thumbs up to let me know. And if you guys want more smoothie recipes, then comment below to let me know. And let's get into it. Okay, so this is a very healthy smoothie. It is full of vitamins because there's quite a few leafy greens involved. So first thing I'm going to add will be some avocado. So I've got half an avocado here and I'm just gonna add a quarter of avocado in total. So I'm just gonna cut that in half, making my way around the pip. And then I'm just gonna scoop that and pour it into my cup over here. And I'm just gonna blend everything in together with my Nutri Bullet or Nutritional Blender. My Nutritional Blender. It's what I use most of the time. It's really handy. Okay, so popped in the avocado. Now I'm adding a handful of spinach. So I've just washed and dried these and that's going in. And then I'm going to add another handful, this time of kale. Now I personally like to take the leaves off the stems and not include the stems. I just find that it's less bitter. I don't know, I think it also blends better as well. And then I'm going to add one banana for sweetness because otherwise it might get a little bit too bitter. I feel like I need a banana in order to down all of my vegetables. Otherwise, yeah, I don't really love the taste, but you'd be surprised how beautiful and sweet it is when you add a little bit of fruit. Now, to make it a little bit more sweet, I'm actually gonna add some coconut water as well. And probably, not really that much, I'd say about a quarter of a glass. And then I'm going to add some rice milk. You can add almond milk or coconut milk can also work really nicely here. And if you guys want to use dairy milk, then you can do that too. And I'm just going to add half a glass worth of rice milk. So I'm filling it up about halfway now. Once it gets to halfway, I'd say that's enough liquid. And then I'm just going to pop the top on and blend it all together. All right, block your ears, guys. <laughs> Yummy, it looks, it looks very unappetizing if you're not really into green, but it tastes really good. Also, sometimes I add frozen banana instead because I want it to be a little bit more cold, especially if I'm really hot. And you can also add some ice cubes too. So I'm gonna pour this all into my mason jar. And I have this most days actually, sometimes for breakfast and then sometimes when I get back from yoga. Yum, I think I made a little bit too much, there's leftovers. I'll get Adam to finish this off. Alright, moment of truth. Mm. It's really yummy guys. So I hope you guys do try this recipe at home. I think it's so healthy, so nutritious, and it's so easy to make. I love making smoothies because they're so quick and easy. They're hassle-free. So if you guys enjoyed today's video, then thumbs up to let me know. And also, if you haven't already subscribed to my channel, then click my face over there and you can join in on the Jessica family. And also to check out some previous videos, just click the image over here. And of course, I will be leaving a link to my study skills book, The High School Survival Guide, down below so you guys can check that out too. But until Wednesday, for my study tip and lifestyle videos, have a very happy and productive week. Bye. Mm. This is so good. Good for me, good for my body. I love it so much. <laughs>